Good morning, everyone. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Welcome to the day 12 prayers of the 21 day MFM Pray Your Way into Marital Breakthrough Program 2023. We're in section two entitled My Marriage Come Forth. Resurrection Power of God. Enter our marriages. Enter our marital lives in Jesus name. Amen. Let us read Psalm 122. Psalm 122. I was glad when they said unto me, Let us go into the house of the Lord. Our feet shall stand within thy gates, O Jerusalem. Jerusalem is builded as a city that is compact together. Whither the tribes go up, the tribes of the Lord, unto the testimony of Israel, to give thanks unto the name of the Lord. For there are set thrones of judgment, the thrones of the house of David. Pray for the peace of Jerusalem. They shall prosper that love thee. Peace be within thy walls and prosperity within thy palaces. For my brethren and companions' sake, I will now say, Peace be within thee. Because of the house of the Lord our God, I will seek thy good. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen, amen. Yes, let's give thanks unto the Lord. Let's praise the Lord God for this wonderful day, this beautiful day for us to see the dawn of this new day. Thank you, Lord God, for your favor, your mercy upon our lives. Let's go ahead and give all glory to the King of Kings. Praise him. Praise him. He's worthy to be adored. He's worthy to be magnified. We were able to open our eyes this morning. That's not to be taken for granted. We were able to feed ourselves. We're able to walk. Let's not take that for granted. Let's praise him. Let's worship him. Let's adore him. He's worthy to be praised and he's worthy to be magnified. He is the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. He is the great I am. We call him wonderful. We call him counselor. He is an excellent God. Praise him. Worship him. Adore him. He is the only true God. He is the God above all gods. All the other gods are the works of man. We serve the only true and living God. Worship him. Adore him. He is the Lord of war. He's the mighty man in battle. Thank you, Lord God, for fighting our battles. Thank you, Lord God, for providing for us. Thank you, Lord God, for delivering us, for healing us, for saving us, and for redeeming us. Praise Him. Worship Him. He's worthy to be adored. Magnify His name. Magnify His holy name. Magnify His hallowed name. We know Him as the Rock of Ages, and He is the Ancient of Days. He's older than the oldest. He's greater than the greatest, and He's better than the best. He is the Unconquerable Conqueror. He's the the one who makes all things possible. Worship him. Adore him. Lord, we thank you for everything that you do for us daily. Thank you, Lord God, for your love, your care, your mercy, and your protection. Lord, we love you. We adore you. We glorify you. And we magnify you, Lord God, for who you are. In Jesus' name, we've praised him and we thanked him. Let us repent and confess our sins. The word of the Lord says that all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. And if we say that there is no sin in us, then the truth is not within us. And if the truth is not within us, then we are filled with abomination. God is a holy God and cannot behold abomination. We do want the Lord to hear us. So let's ask the Lord to rid us of this abomination, of the sin, of the iniquity in our lives, in our families, and in our bloodline. Lord, we know that you are a merciful God. Show us your mercy. Show us your compassion. And remove our sin. Remove our iniquity as far away from us as the east is from the west. Let the blood of Jesus wash us. Let the blood of Jesus wash the stain of sin, the stain of iniquity away from our lives. And Lord, we also forgive those who've trespassed against us. We forgive those who've sinned against us. Anyone against whom we're holding unforgiveness, anyone against whom we're holding offense, anyone against whom we're holding a grudge, we forgive them and we release them from our spirit in Jesus' name. Amen. Let us cover ourselves and our families with the blood of Jesus. 
I soak my body, my soul, my spirit, and that of my family members with the blood of Jesus. I cover myself and my family members with the blood of Jesus from the crown of our heads to the soles of our feet. We wash ourselves inside and outside with the blood of Jesus. Every place where our feet trod, we soak it in the blood of Jesus. Covenant blood of Jesus, cover us. Passover blood of Jesus, cover us, we pray. In Jesus' name, we are covered with the blood of Jesus. Amen, amen. Yes, Psalm 122 says, We were glad when they said, Let us go to the house of the Lord so that we can praise and worship the Lord. Worship Him. Sing your favorite song of worship. Sing your favorite song of praise in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Let somebody shout a big hallelujah. I can hear some people shouting, Let somebody shout a big hallelujah. Receive my praise, O oh God. Receive my praise, O oh God. Glory and honor we give unto you. Receive my praise, O oh God. 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 Say glory. Says yes, nobody can say no. When Jesus says yes, nobody can say no. When my Jesus says yes, nobody can say no. When Jesus says yes, nobody can say no. When my father opens the door, nobody can shut it. I got a favor for Edo.
praise. Arise, O Lord, for our sake. Amen. Next, we've got our scripture reading taken from the book of Daniel, chapter 4. Do read along with us. May the Lord bless the reading and hearing of his word. Amen. Daniel 4. Nebuchadnezzar the king, unto all people, nations, and languages that dwell in all the earth, peace be multiplied unto you. I thought it good to show the signs and wonders that the high God hath wrought toward me. How great are his signs, and how mighty are his wonders! His kingdom is an everlasting kingdom, and his dominion is from generation to generation. I, Nebuchadnezzar, was at rest in mine house, and flourishing in my palace. I saw a dream which made me afraid, and the thoughts upon my bed, and the visions of my head troubled me. Therefore made I a decree to bring in all the wise men of Babylon before me, that they might make known unto me the interpretation of the dream. Then came in the magicians, the astrologers, the Chaldeans, and the soothsayers, and I told the dream before them, but they did not make known unto me the interpretation thereof. But at the last Daniel came in before me, whose name was Belteshazzar, according to the name of my God, and in whom is the spirit of the holy gods. And before him I told the dream, saying, O Belteshazzar, master of the magicians, because I know that the spirit of the holy gods is in thee, and no secret troubleth thee, tell me the visions of my dream that I have seen, and the interpretation thereof. Thus were the visions of mine head in my bed. I saw, and behold, a tree in the midst of the earth, and the height thereof was great. The tree grew and was strong, and the height thereof reached unto heaven, and the sight thereof to the end of all the earth. The leaves thereof were fair, and the fruit thereof much, and in it was meat for all. The beasts of the field had shadow under it, and the fowls of the heaven dwelt in the boughs thereof, and all flesh was fed of it. I saw in the visions of my head upon my bed, and behold, a watcher and an holy one came down from heaven. He cried aloud and said thus, Hew down the tree, and cut off his branches, shake off his leaves, and scatter his fruit. Let the beasts get away from under it, and the fowls from his branches. Nevertheless, leave the stump of his roots in the earth, even with a band of iron and brass, in the tender grass of the field, and let it be wet with the dew of heaven, and let his portion be with the beasts in the grass of the earth. Let his heart be changed from man's, and let a beast's heart be given unto him, and let seven times pass over him. This matter is by the decree of the watchers, and the demand by the word of the holy ones, to the intent that the living may know that the Most High ruleth in the kingdom of men, and giveth it to whomsoever he will, and setteth up over it the basest of men. This dream I, King Nebuchadnezzar, have seen. Now, thou, O Belteshazzar, declare the interpretation thereof, for as much as all the wise men of my kingdom are not able to make known unto me the interpretation. But thou art able, for the spirit of the holy gods is in thee. Then Daniel, whose name was Belteshazzar, was astonished for one hour, and his thoughts troubled him. The king spake and said, Belteshazzar, let not the dream or the interpretation thereof trouble thee. Belteshazzar answered and said, My lord, the dream be to them that hate thee, and the interpretation thereof to thine enemies. The tree that thou sawest, which grew and was strong, whose height reached unto the heaven, and the sight thereof to all the earth, whose leaves were fair, and the fruit thereof much, and in it was meat for all, under which the beasts of the field dwelt, and upon whose branches the fowls of the heaven had their habitation. It is thou, O king, that art grown and become strong, for thy greatness is grown and reacheth unto heaven, and thy dominion to the end of the earth. And whereas the king saw a watcher and an holy one coming down from heaven, and saying, Hew the tree down and destroy it, yet leave the stump of the roots thereof in the earth, even with a band of iron and brass, in the tender grass of the field, and let it be wet with the dew of heaven, and let his portion be with the beasts of the field, till seven times pass over him. This is the interpretation, O king, and this is the decree of the Most High, which is come upon my lord the king that they shall drive thee from men, and thy dwelling shall be with the beasts of the field, and they shall make thee to eat grass as oxen, and they shall wet thee with the dew of heaven, and seven times shall pass over thee, till thou know that the Most High ruleth in the kingdom of men, and giveth it to whomsoever he will. And whereas they commanded to leave the stump of the tree roots, the kingdom shall be sure unto thee, after that thou shalt have known that the heavens do rule. 
Wherefore, O king, let my counsel be acceptable unto thee, and break off thy sins by righteousness, and thine iniquities by showing mercy to the poor, if it may be a lengthening of thy tranquillity. All this came upon the king Nebuchadnezzar. At the end of twelve months he walked in the palace of the kingdom of Babylon. The king spake and said, Is not this great Babylon that I have built for the house of the kingdom by the might of my power, and for the honor of my majesty? While the word was in the king's mouth, there fell a voice from heaven, saying, O king Nebuchadnezzar, to thee it is spoken, the kingdom is departed from thee, and they shall drive thee from men, and thy dwelling shall be with the beasts of the field. They shall make thee to eat grass as oxen, and seven times shall pass over thee, until thou know that the Most High ruleth in the kingdom of men, and giveth it to whomsoever he will. The same hour was the thing fulfilled upon Nebuchadnezzar, and he was driven from men, and did eat grass as oxen, and his body was wet with the dew of heaven, till his hairs were grown like eagles' feathers, and his nails like birds' claws. And at the end of the days I, Nebuchadnezzar, lifted up mine eyes unto heaven, and mine understanding returned unto me, and I blessed the Most High, and I praised and honored him that liveth for ever, whose dominion is an everlasting dominion, and his kingdom is from generation to generation. And all the inhabitants of the earth are reputed as nothing, and he doeth according to his will in the army of heaven, and among the inhabitants of the earth. And none can stay his hand, or say unto him, What doest thou? At the same time my reason returned unto me, and for the glory of my kingdom mine honor and brightness returned unto me, and my counselors and my lords sought unto me, and I was established in my kingdom, and excellent majesty was added unto me. Now I, Nebuchadnezzar, praise and extol and honor the King of heaven, all whose works are truth, and his ways judgment, and those that walk in pride he is able to abase. Thank you, Lord, for your word. Amen. May we praise, extol, and honor the King of heaven, whose works are all truth. Amen. Next, we've got our scripture confession, and it's taken from the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 3, verse 11. He hath made everything beautiful in his time, also, he hath set the world in their heart, so that no man can find out the work that God maketh from the beginning to the end. Amen. God makes all of us beautiful. We are all beautiful creatures, all beautiful creations of God. God's plan for our lives is clothed in splendor. It's clothed in magnificence and in beauty. God's plan for us stretches into eternity, and in this world, we cannot always comprehend it. Amen. Oh, Lord God, thank you for making us beautiful. Thank you for making everyone and everything beautiful in your time. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Deliver me fire of the Holy Ghost. 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 Deliver us in Jesus' name. Amen. All visible and invisible walls against my marital breakthrough break in the name of Jesus. All visible and invisible walls 
against my marital breakthrough and the marital breakthrough of my family members break, 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 break by fire in the name of Jesus. All visible and invisible walls against the marital breakthroughs of my family members and I break, break, break by thunder, break by fire, break by force, break, break, break in the name of Jesus, break all visible and invisible walls against our marital breakthroughs, break, 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 break by fire, break by thunder, break in the name of Jesus. Amen. I will not be a victim of sudden sickness after marriage in the name of Jesus. I will not be a victim of sudden sickness after marriage in the name of Jesus. My family members and I will not be victims of sudden sickness, strange illness after marriage in the name of Jesus. My family members and I will not be victims of sudden strange illness illness after marriage in the name of Jesus. Amen. I'm pretty sure a lot of us know people personally or know of people who after marriage, either the husband or the wife develops a strange illness, which sometimes cannot be treated by, by uh, modern medicine. Amen. That's not our portion in Jesus' name. We will not be victims of sudden, strange illness, sickness after marriage in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every stronghold of thoughts, images, and pictures of marital failure in my heart be pulled down by fire in the name of Jesus. Every stronghold of thoughts, images, and pictures of marital failure in my heart be pulled down by fire in the name of Jesus. Every stronghold of thoughts, images, pictures of marital failure in my heart and in the hearts of my family members be pulled down by fire, be pulled down by fire, be pulled down, be pulled down, be pulled on by fire in the name of Jesus. Every stronghold of thoughts, images, and pictures of marital failure in my heart or in the hearts of my family members, be pulled down by fire, be pulled down by fire, be pulled down by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Every stronghold of thoughts, images, and pictures of marital failure in our hearts be pulled down by fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh God, let my marriage be exemplary in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, let my marriage be exemplary in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, let my marriage and the marriages of my family members be exemplary in the name of Jesus. My Father, my God, let my marriage, let the marriages of my family members be exemplary in the name of Jesus. My Father, my God, let my marriage and the marriages of my family members be exemplary, be models of Divinely appointed marriages in the name of Jesus, my Father, my God. Let our marriages be exemplary in the name of Jesus. An example of an exemplary marriage is that of our general overseer, Dr. D.K. Lukoya, and his precious wife. We consistently refer to them as the model couple. Praise the Lord. My Father, my God, let our marriages be exemplary in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let all the demonic obstacles that have been established in the heart of my ordained partner vanish in the name of Jesus. Let all the demonic obstacles that have been established in the heart of my divine partner vanish in the name of Jesus. Let all the demonic obstacles that have been established in the heart of my ordained partner vanish, vanish, vanish by the power in the blood of Jesus. Let all the demonic obstacles that have been established in the heart of my divine partner vanish, be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Let all the demonic obstacles that have been established in the heart of my ordained partner and the ordained partners of my family members vanish, be destroyed, vanish, be destroyed by fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, 
always help me to identify evil marital traps in the name of Jesus. Lord, always help me to identify evil marital traps in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, help my family members and I to identify evil marital traps in the name of Jesus. My Father, my God, heighten our spiritual senses so that we can identify these evil traps in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, help us to identify and avoid evil marital traps in the name of Jesus. My Father, my God, always help us to identify and avoid evil marital traps in the name of Jesus. Let those setting evil marital traps for us, let the powers setting evil marital traps for us be caught in their own traps in the name of Jesus. Amen. You unfriendly friends, I command you in the name of Jesus, depart from me in the name of Jesus. You unfriendly friends, I command you in the name of Jesus, depart from me now in the name of Jesus. You unfriendly friends, I command you in the name of Jesus, depart from my family members and I now. Depart from my family members and I now. Depart, depart, depart from us now by fire in the name of Jesus. You unfriendly friends, I command you in the name of Jesus, depart from us now. Depart from us now. Depart from us now by fire in the name of Jesus. Let the fire Fire of God, pursue you out of our lives in the name of Jesus. Fire of God, pursue unfriendly friends out of our lives. Pursue them, pursue them. Let the fire of God pursue unfriendly friends out of our lives in Jesus' name. Amen. Let every power chasing away my partner be paralyzed in the name of Jesus. Let every power chasing away our partners be paralyzed in the name of Jesus. Every power chasing away my divinely ordained partner, chasing away the divinely ordained partners of my family members and I be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed by fire, be paralyzed by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Every power chasing away my divinely ordained husband, every power chasing away the divinely ordained spouses of my family members, be paralyzed by fire, be paralyzed by thunder, be paralyzed by the power in the word of the Lord in the name of Jesus. Every power chasing away our divinely ordained partners, be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every witchcraft power chasing away my marital fulfillment, fall down and die in the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft power working against my marital fulfillment, working against the marital fulfillment of my family members and I, fall down and die, fall down and die, fall down and die, die, die by fire in the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft power working against the marital fulfillment of my family members and I, fall, die, fall, die, fall down and die by fire in the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft power working against our marital fulfillment, fall down and die, fall down and die, fall down and die in the name of Jesus. Amen. The enemy of my marriage will not convert my destiny to rags in the name of Jesus. The enemy of my marriage will not convert my destiny to rags in the name of Jesus. The enemy of my marriage will not convert my destiny to rags in the name of Jesus. The enemy of my marriage, the enemy of the marriages of my family members will not convert our destinies to rags, will not convert our destinies to rags, will not convert our destinies to rags in the name of Jesus. The enemies of our marriages will not convert our destinies to rags in the name of Jesus. Our marriage will be prosperous. Our marriages will not be marriages of financial struggle or any kind of struggle in the name of Jesus. The enemy of our marriages will not convert our destinies to rags in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every incantation and ritual working against my marriage be disgraced in the name of Jesus. Every incantation and ritual working against my marriage, be disgraced in the name of Jesus. Every incantation, ritual, spell, 
chant, working against my marriage, be disgraced, be disgraced, be disgraced in the name of Jesus. Every incantation, ritual, spell, jinx, working against my marriage and against the marriages of my family members, be disgraced, be disgraced, be disgraced, be disgraced, be destroyed, be disgraced, be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Every incantation, ritual, spell, jinx, work against my marriage and against the marriages of my family members, be disgraced, die, be disgraced, die, be disgraced, and die, 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 die in the name of Jesus, die. Every incantation, ritual, spell, jinx, working against our marriages, be disgraced and die in the name of Jesus. Amen. Satan, I resist and rebuke your effort to change my marital destiny in the name of Jesus. Satan, I resist and rebuke your effort to change my marital destiny in the name of Jesus. Satan, I resist. My family members and I resist and rebuke your effort to change our marital destinies in the name of Jesus. Satan, my family members and I resist and rebuke. We resist and we rebuke. We resist and we rebuke your effort to change our marital destinies in the name of Jesus. Satan, my family members and I stand on the word of the Lord and we resist and we rebuke by fire your effort to change our marital destinies in the name of Jesus. Amen. I break every soul tie with anyone I have ever gotten into a relationship with. Fall down and die in the name of Jesus. I break... Every evil soul tie with anyone I've ever gotten into a relationship with fall down and die in the name of Jesus. My family members and I break, break, break by fire. Every soul tie with anyone we've ever gotten into relationships with in the name of Jesus. Every evil soul tie fall down and die. Fall down and die. Fall down and die in the name of Jesus. My family members and I break, 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 break by thunder. Every soul tie with anyone we've ever gotten into a relationship with. Every evil soul tie fall, die, fall, die, fall down and die by fire. In the name of Jesus, my family members and I break, break. We break by fire every soul tie with anyone we've ever gotten into a relationship with. Every evil soul tie fall down and die by fire. In the name of Jesus, amen. I dash every evil clock controlling my life against the wall of fire. In the name of Jesus, I dash every evil wall clock controlling my life against the wall of fire in the name of Jesus. You evil clock controlling my life and my family, we dash you against the wall of fire. We dash you against the wall of fire. We dash you. We dash you. We dash you against the wall of fire and we break you into pieces in the name of Jesus. Every evil wall clock controlling my life, controlling the lives of my family members. We dash you against the wall of fire. We dash you against the wall of fire. We dash you against the wall of fire. Be destroyed permanently and burned to ashes in the name of Jesus. Every evil wall clock controlling my life and the lives of my family members. We dash you against the wall of fire, break, break, break into pieces, never to regroup again and be destroyed permanently, catch fire, burn to ashes in Jesus' name. Amen. By the power in the blood of Jesus, I command all dreams and visions concerning my marriage that is not manifested to receive life in the name of Jesus. By the power in the blood of Jesus, I command all dreams and visions concerning my marriage that have not manifested to receive life in the name of Jesus. By the power in the blood of Jesus, my family members and I command all dreams and visions concerning our marriages that have not manifested to receive life, to receive life, to receive life now in the name of Jesus. By the power in the blood of Jesus, my family members and I command all dreams and visions concerning 
are marriages that have not manifested to receive life, to receive life, to receive life now in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Agents from the Marine Kingdom assigned to block my marriage be disgraced by the fire of God in the name of Jesus. Agents from the Marine Kingdom assigned to block my marriage be disgraced by the fire of God in the name of Jesus. Agents from the Marine Kingdom assigned to block my marriage and the marriages of my family members be disgraced, be disgraced, be disgraced by the fire of God in the name of Jesus. Be disgraced, be disgraced, be disgraced by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Be disgraced, be disgraced, be disgraced by the word of the Lord in the name of Jesus. Agents from the Marine Kingdom assigned to block the marriages of my family members and I be disgraced, be destroyed, be disgraced, be destroyed, be disgraced by the fire of God in the name of Jesus. Be disgraced, be destroyed, be disgraced, be destroyed by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Agents from the Marine Kingdom assigned to block our marriages, be disgraced, be destroyed by the fire of God and by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every bad luck spirit against my marriage give way by the Spirit of God in the name of Jesus. Every bad luck spirit against my marriage give way by the Spirit of God in the name of Jesus. Every bad luck spirit against my marriage against the marriages of my family members, give way by the Spirit of God, give way by the Spirit of God, give way by the Spirit of God in the name of Jesus. Every bad luck spirit against my marriage, against the marriages of my family members, give way by the Spirit of God, give way by the Spirit of God, give way by the Spirit of God in the name of Jesus. Our marriages will not be fraught with bad luck, but our marriages will be filled with good fortune, with blessings in the name of Jesus. Every bad luck spirit against our marriages, give way, give way, give way by the Spirit of God in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every evil curse and covenant against fulfilling my marital destiny break by fire and thunder of God in the name of Jesus. Every evil curse and covenant against fulfilling my marital destiny break by fire and thunder of God in the name of Jesus. Every evil curse and covenant against fulfilling my marital destiny and the marital destinies of my family members break by fire and thunder of God. Break by fire and thunder of God. Break, 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 break. Break by fire and thunder of God in the name of Jesus. Every evil curse and covenant against fulfilling the marital destinies of my family members and I break, 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 break by fire and thunder of God in the name of Jesus. Every evil curse and covenant against fulfilling our marital destinies break 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 by the fire and thunder of God in the name of Jesus amen every mountain of satanic confrontation in every department of my life crumble now in the name of Jesus every mountain of satanic confrontation in every department of my life and my family Crumble, crumble, crumble now by fire in the name of Jesus. Every mountain of satanic confrontation in every department of my life and the lives of my family members crumble now, crumble now, crumble now by fire in the name of Jesus. Who art thou, O great mountain? Who art thou, O great mountain of satanic confrontation in my life and in my family? Become a plain now. Become a plain now. Crumble, crumble, crumble in the name of Jesus. Every mountain of satanic confrontation in every department of our lives, crumble, crumble, crumble now by fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. I render every Goliath defying my prayers, impotent in the name of Jesus. I render every department defying my prayers, impotent in the name of Jesus. I render every Goliath defying my prayers, 
impotent in the name of Jesus. I render every Goliath defying my prayers and the prayers of my family members impotent in the name of Jesus. Stones of fire locate the forehead of every Goliath assigned against our prayers in the name of Jesus. My family members and I render Every Goliath defying our prayers impotent in the name of Jesus. Every Goliath defying our prayers. We destroy your power. We destroy your power. We destroy your power by fire in the name of Jesus. My family members and I render every Goliath defying our prayers impotent by fire in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Throughout this day, O oh Lord God, let all of creation arise and favor us meritly in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord God, rearrange, reorganize, revise every situation, person, place, and event for our marital destinies to be fulfilled in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord God, create opportunities for our marital destinies to be fulfilled in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's pray for our General Overseer, Dr. D.K. Olukoya. We thank God for his life. We thank God for the lives of his dear wife and their children. We soak them in the blood of Jesus, and we surround them with the fire of the Holy Ghost. We decree that it is well with them, their family, and their ministry. In the name of Jesus, they will not faint, nor will they grow weary in their divine assignment. In the name of Jesus, every evil curse and covenant assigned against them fulfilling their destinies on earth. O oh Lord God, destroy, destroy, destroy those evil curses and covenants in the name of Jesus. Every mountain of satanic confrontation against our general overseer, his family, their ministry, be destroyed, be destroyed, crumble, be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Lord God, you said that you'll build your church and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. And dear Lord, we also pray for our intercessors and for all genuinely called men and women of God who are seeking you in spirit and in truth. Lord God, every mountain of satanic confrontation against their lives, against their calling, be destroyed, become a plane, be destroyed, become a plane by fire in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen, amen, amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Father, let all the words of our prayers be fastened unto the heavens in the name of Jesus. As a result of the prayer you have prayed today, the seal of the Holy Ghost, the seal of the power of God comes upon your prayers in the name of Jesus. The Lord God that answereth by fire shall answer all your prayers by fire in the name of Jesus. And any power that wants to attack you as a result of the prayers you have prayed here today shall be put to shame in the name of Jesus. I bless you in the name of the Lord. Your going in your community shall be blessing, sir. Every tragedy left in this year is minus you and your family in the name of Jesus. Sir. Every battle that does not want to allow you to rest shall die in the name of Jesus. Sir. And any failure assigned to catch up with you shall be disgraced in the name of Jesus. And any storm assigned to wait for you in the future shall expire, shall expire, shall expire in the name of Jesus. Shall expire in the name of Jesus. Your breakthrough shall be non-negotiable in the mighty name of Jesus. For the hand of God shall arise for your sake and bless you to a mighty degree. It is well with you. Thank you, Heavenly Father. The God that answered by fire shall continue to be your God. Thank you, King of kings and Lord of lords. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. A sevenfold amen, 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 amen. Let us share the grace in fellowship, the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Seven glorious hallelujah. Let's go. Hallelujah. 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 Every praise to our God. Everyone who worships one of our God. Every praise. Every praise to our God. Every, 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 every praise.